Okay, this is gonna be a really unedited video because I'm filming this on the Wednesday before this goes up because today was the finale of Big Brother and I have a lot of thoughts and I'm very, very angry right now. I'm angry for a lot of reasons. Partially because in between all the breaks of the show, I'm trying to finish my math homework and this math homework is making no sense and I'm done with it, which made me even more done with the show. But I have plenty of reasons to be done with the show. Let's start with the jury. I am so mad. I thought that the jury was going to be fine and like not emotional, but they 100% voted on emotion there was no way that like they just thought oh yeah josh played a better game than paul in what world is that possible they were all just salty that paul played all of them so they decided to throw their vote to josh versus paul and it's just it makes me so mad i don't get how this season exists i want this season to be deleted paul lost by one vote Again, we'll get to that in a second. And America somehow voted for Cody to be the best house guest? I... Explain to me how that trash person somehow won America's favorite house guest. Like, all he did was not show any emotion, talk about how much he hated Paul, and like, be sexist and homophobic and transphobic. Like, what else did he do? Like, he talked about how much he liked Jessica. That was it. <laughs> like, I, I, I don't, how, how? I, I, this season is the worst season. And like, the seasons have already been pretty shitty. Like, I watched season 17, that one was bad. But this season, how did it, how? How, how? Paul played the best game. I don't care about your opinions of him as a person. I get that he's done a lot of problematic things and all of those opinions are very much valid. But like, how did he lose when he has literally won nine competitions and had a hand in every single eviction? Everyone's just salty because he had a hand in their eviction. Because he had a hand in every eviction. Like, everyone is so salty. And it makes me so mad because Paul 100% deserved to win. I'm not saying that Josh didn't deserve to win. I love Josh. I'm very happy that he won because I feel like he also deserved to win. But out of the two, Paul deserved to win more because he played a better game. He won competitions. He orchestrated the entire game. Like Jessica said, because Jessica isn't an idiot, that Paul played the best game. He like controlled everyone and therefore deserves to win. But the jury's salty because he played them. And it makes me so mad that they all threw like an emotional vote to have him lose. And it's just, oh my god, I'm so mad. It's so dumb. It's so dumb. Like, they have all the right to be angry. I would probably be angry too, but they need to separate personal and game. People who can't do that make me so mad. Because they're all like, Paul, we had friendship. Why would you stab me in the back? And I'm like... You're still friends! That's on a personal level, on a game level, you had to be taken out! That's just how it works! Like, Alex who said, you know, even if I knew I was gonna lose against you, I would've taken you to Final Two. That's so dumb! Who would do that? That's just throwing away $500,000 for, like, a friendship? That's so dumb! You came in this game not to make friends, not to make showmances, but to win $500,000. So people who are expecting Paul to throw away his game for them because he made alliances with them or whatever are crazy. They're crazy. <sighs> it's so dumb. It makes no sense in my mind how they all expected him to like make, to keep all of these alliances. Like, the, he, they had to realize that like in all of these alliances they would fail, right? Like, yeah, Paul aligned himself with a lot of people, and yeah, he played a very shady game where he lied to everyone, but the fact that he could pull it off so seamlessly and that nobody figured it out until they got to jury shows how good and strategic his gameplay was and how he deserves to win. Everyone in jury just took their eviction so personally, and it pisses me off because it just it wasn't personal. Nothing in that game is personal. Like, they need to be able to separate game and personal. And I don't think anyone in jury really did, except for the people who voted for Paul. I'm not just saying this because I, I like Paul and I've wanted him to win since season 18. I want to put that out there to make it very clear. I am probably biased, but I just, it's because he's a better player. He's 
worked so hard this season keeping all of his alliances separated and making sure that they all thought different things and he orchestrated everything. He got everyone in that Ready, Set, Go competition to throw it for him. That's crazy. Like, the fact that he could do that just shows how good his gameplay was, like, socially, it was phenomenal, but everyone is so salty that they're not at the end because they put their trust in Paul, so they don't, so they didn't vote for him, and that's so dumb because that's not his fault, that's their own fault. You never put your whole gameplay into another person. You always need to rely on yourself and your ability to win competitions. Otherwise, that's your fault. You suck. What Dr. Will whatever said, he was like, you're all just sore losers. You're all just mad that you're not there and that he played you. Like, that's not his fault. Like, I don't get why they're so mad at him for like overplaying the game or something. Like, he lied too much. Like, how is... How is that a thing? Like, that's fine if you're mad at him for playing a dishonest game, but you can't say that that game, his dishonest game, was worse than Josh's game. Josh, I feel like, had very strong points to win because I feel like he he was very smart and he tried to downplay his smartness because I think he's way smarter than a lot of people give him credit for, but there's no way his gameplay was as smart as Paul's gameplay. Like, he aligned himself with Paul, which was smart, but Paul did everything around him. Like, Paul used Josh, just like he used everyone else, to get to the final two. And for that, he should have won. I'm just, ugh. He really deserved to win, and I'm so mad. Because he deserved to win last season, and he deserved to win this season. And he lost both times by one point. And there is no way, no matter what anybody tells me, that they didn't plan that. There is no way in hell that those jurors did not plan for him to lose by one point. There is no way. I don't believe it. There's, they had to have. Like, they, it was just so perfectly timed and Cody was the last vote. And I don't think anyone expected Cody to vote for Josh. And I know for a fact that Cody voted for Josh out of pettiness and just to like screw over Paul. Because I know that like logically Cody knows that Paul played a better game. And it just, it makes no sense that he lost. I'm done with this season. This is the dumbest season because it has the dumbest people playing in it. They're people that, one, got played by Paul. It wasn't really hard for Paul to play them though, but they were, they're really dumb. And then they go into jury and get mad at Paul for playing them when they really should get mad at themselves for getting played. They saw in like those, those cutscenes in the diary room where they're like, I trust Paul. I put my whole game in Paul and I'm like, that's not Paul's fault. Like, yes, you lie, you backstab. That's big brother. That's the whole game. Expect the unexpected is their tagline. So if you get to jury and realize you have all been played by the same person, I don't get how they all collectively think, oh yeah, that person doesn't deserve to win because they're upset. Like, they all let their emotions rule their votes and that makes me so mad because Paul deserved to win. The number one person I'm mad at is Alex because Alex is extra petty and I'm so done with her. She is so annoying. I was like this close to voting for her for America's Favorite House Guest. Thankfully, I just forgot about it altogether, but she is so mad and I don't get why. She's just taking it so personally, but I can't understand why she can't separate personal and game. Like she's smart. She's played a smart game, except for, you know, putting all of her trust into someone that wasn't her and when she won the HOH not putting up Christmas and Josh, that was dumb. But she is so mad at Paul for lying to her. I'm so confused. In her like speech when she put in the key, it was so obvious that she voted for Josh. She was like, I'm going to vote for the person who stabbed me in the front, not in the back. And I'm like, how did he stab you in the back? He came up to you after he won the veto and said, I can't pull you off because if I go to final two with you, they're gonna vote for you over me. And that's 100% true. If Paul and Alex were both up there, Alex would have won by a mile. So he played what was best for his game. And Alex gets mad because he stabbed her in the back 
Where does that come from? Stabbing her in the back would be going to the nomination ceremony after telling her, yeah, I'm gonna pull you off, I'm gonna pull you off, and going to the nomination ceremony and be like, I've decided not to use the power of veto. Like, that would be stabbing you in the back. He came up to her, honestly, and said, I cannot pull you down because it's best for my game. They all think that people should just throw their games for them, and it makes no sense. Like, just because you, like, make a bond with someone, and you make an alliance with someone, doesn't mean you should throw your game for them. That makes no sense. Like, just because they're your ride or die, like, you're... It, it's so dumb. Like, they think that these alliances take precedence over winning $500,000, which is what everyone came in this game for. I'm so confused by why everyone is taking this so personally. There are some people who I think thought logically and didn't let emotion cloud their judgment, and I think those are the people that voted for Paul, because they realized they didn't let their emotions of being upset that he backstabbed them, or whatever. <laughs> cloud their judgment on their votes like Alex I just I hate Alex I'm so done with Alex anyways this video is me just ranting because I'm very mad and I still have homework to do so to summarize Paul deserved to win but so did Josh because I love him and I'm very happy that he won everyone that voted for Josh is just petty all of the jurors need to separate personal from game and the majority of the people in jury are idiots Along with the rest of America, who somehow voted for Cody, that trash person, to be America's favorite. This season is just, just awful. Cancel this season. Delete it now.